In this tutorial, we will show you how to fix the blue screen of death stop error 0x0. This particular error occurs very rarely. In the kernel, when the expression parser exceeds beyond its buffer, the stop error occurs on the screen. So basically, when you're booting up the Windows 2000 advanced server in normal condition, the error would appear on the screen and would automatically restart your system. Once the system boots up in normal condition, download the latest service pack for Windows 2000 from Microsoft's official website. Once the service pack has been downloaded, extract the files on your system and open up the setup wizard. Do remember to close all the applications you might have opened before proceeding with the installation. Next, you'll be required to agree to the license terms and agreements. In the next window, you'll be asked whether you want to archive the files or not. Basically, archiving the files allows you to remove the service pack later on. But if you have sufficient disk space, you can leave the default option as it is and move on to the next step. With that done, it will start inspecting the current configuration, and in the second stage, it will check the necessary requirements for the installation. Then it will start backing up the system files and install the new files. Once the service pack is installed completely, click on the Finish button, and this will automatically restart Windows so the changes can take effect. Once the computer reboots, let's open up the My Computer Properties window. Over here, you can see that the Service Pack 4 has been successfully installed, and now you will never have to see the 0x0 stop error again while running Windows 2000. Thanks for watching. This was a HowTech.tv tutorial.